Hello, I'm Mark Eccles from Apogee Google Cloud. In a previous video of the Edge Micro Gateway module, we covered how to configure northbound one-way TLS on the Edge Micro Gateway. In this video, we will look at how to configure northbound two-way TLS. In a two-way TLS handshake, both the client and server authenticate each other by presenting their respective certificates to ensure that both parties are mutually trusted. In this diagram, we have introduced a new entity called the Client Key Store. It contains a public certificate and a private key. When a server is two-way TLS enabled, it will request for a client certificate in the server hello message. If the client trusts the server certificate, it will present its own certificate back to the server. If the client does not have its own certificate, then the handshake will fail. If the client sends the proper certificate, then the server will verify the certificate with its trust store. Once the client is authenticated, the data transfer begins. Now let's look at the steps involved in setting up northbound two-way TLS on Edge Micro Gateway. As we've seen in the previous video of this module for one-way TLS, we needed to obtain a certificate and private key for the server. Now for two-way TLS, we will follow the same steps but we will also need to obtain a certificate and private key for the client as well. Once we have the certificates and corresponding private key prepared, the second step is to update the Edge Micro YAML configuration file for the desired organization and environment. Ensure that the client certificate and its complete chain is available in pen format on the file system so that we can reference it from the Edge Micro Gateway config. Then locate the SSL option that we added earlier, and now add the path to the client cert or cert chain. We also set request cert to true, so that the Edge Micro Gateway requests a client certificate during the TLS handshake. Finally, we will reload the Edge Micro Gateway to pick up the new configuration changes so that it starts requiring two-way TLS connections. Now, I will modify the Edge Micro YAML configuration file. This can be found in the .edge micro directory under your home directory. First of all, I will add the request cert option under the SSL section. This will instruct Edge Micro Gateway, which acts as a TLS server, to request a client certificate in the server hello message of a TLS handshake. Now I will provide the fully qualified file path to the trust store. Next, I will reload the Edge Micro server so that it can pick up the new client TLS configuration. It seems that everything went well. Now let's try sending a request over HTTPS using Postman. Oh dear, looks like there was a problem. Let's have a look at the Postman console to see what went wrong. Ah, the TLS handshake failed because Postman did not provide a client certificate. In a two-way TLS connection, a valid client certificate must be passed in response to the server hello message. Let's try the same command again, except this time I will configure Postman to send a client certificate for this URL. Great, we now have two-way TLS encrypted connections between the client and the Edge Micro Gateway. The Micro Gateway will now only accept connections from clients with valid trusted certificates. Check out the links in the video description for our online documentation and to the Apogee community where you can post questions or feedback that you might have. Thank you and stay tuned for the next video where we will cover southbound TLS.